All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a rather new, uh, not a rather new, it's a rather old game. It's a new game on the channel, though, called Alice Madness Returns. Uh, it's an American McGee game, uh, it, in case you aren't familiar with, with that particular guy. He has some, uh, some dark games, some, some rather dark games, um, this is a very, very, very dark version of Alice, uh, you know, Alice in Wonderland, um, or Wonderland, not Wonderland, <laughs> don't know what Wonderland is. Uh, this is a sequel to his original game, which is, um, Mary Schmiggy's Alice, which I don't know if I'll ever get around to play, uh, it's a very old game with very, very odd controls, um, maybe later, uh, from what I've I played the original. I played this game before the original, and I didn't really notice too many areas where I'm like, "What the fuck is going on?" But I mean, they'll be kind of relaxed on characters. Although, if you've ever read Alice in Wonderland slash seen a movie or like done anything with Alice, you probably understand most of the characters anyway. Um, yeah, so this is a very dark rendition of Alice in Wonderland, and it is a rather odd game, as you can tell from the collectibles over here, like. Snout peppered. Sure. Um, yeah, it's a very odd game with uh, brawling. And you, you, I, I don't really know what to talk about with this game because it's so weird at times. So I guess we should just dive right in. Um, I'm going to be a little bitch and go on normal. And I think I fixed the gamma and did everything. I do now with an invert inverted vertical look. I have played most of this. I don't think I ever beat it, though. I got to, like, the last stage and then just never went back and played it. But it is a weird game. That is what I remember. It's a weird and rather fun slasher. a dream it's a memory and it makes me sick i think this is now, the event of the first game focus i guess wait you're floating again weightless a cipher relax <sighs> i'm in hell forget it abandon that memory it's unproductive go to wonderland Wonderland's shattered. It's dead to me. Your preference doesn't signify, girl. Now, Alice, where are you? I'm sailing with a friend. The hair. Mm. It's different somehow. Things have changed. Change is good. It's the first link in the chain of forgetting. What's happening? Are you mad? I'm not mad. Rabbit. That's not right. What's he doing? Is something wrong? Something wrong? No, not that. Don't As I said, a dark for an addition. <laughs> I warned you, it's gonna be fucking yes. creepy. Better now, aren't you? My head's exploded and there's a steam hammer in my chest. Yes, well, the cost of forgetting is high. My memories make me vomit. What can I remember other things? I want to forget. Who would choose to be alone, imprisoned by their broken memories? I'll set you free, Alice. Memory is a curse more often than a blessing. So you've said many times and and i will say again the past must be paid for now 
for our next session, collect those pills from our hunting tent. Very well, Doctor. I forgot how fucking creepy that is. It's my turn to forget, Alex. Now, Charlie, your pa was hung for killing your ma who beat you. Let's forget that, Charlie. The past is dead, Charlie. I forgot how fucking terrifying this game can get sometimes. <laughs> like that intro alone, super brutal. Um, but yeah, so it's a. Uh, this is Alice. Um, she's trying to forget her past and her memories of uh, Wonderland. Wonderland. I keep calling it Wonderland for some reason. Um, and yeah, it's a uh, it's a dark game. I, I I cannot stress that enough. Um, she, oh yeah, she's living in an orphanage. In case you're wondering, I won't try and spoil too much, but this game uses Wonderland as a sort of trippy mindset sort of thing. Oh, there's collectibles. The illustrated news feeds an insatiable appetite for domestic mayhem and industrial disaster. Fire at match factory. Six girls missing. Is there any anything more predictable? The world's gone quite mad. Uh. They're talking about us? You want to... Want to step up, you kid? You look like you had hit in the face with a stick. Now your face is all bloated. Fight me. <laughs> well, I guess we're doing the fighting part later, so. Mr. Payne had no idea how humble a home could be. If not for my drawings and the photographs, he could pass for my room at the asylum. Uh, there's the mushrooms, there's the Mad Hatter, there's Tootle Dee and Tootle Dum, the rabbit or the hare. I always call them the hair. Uh, the cards. Who got fucking murdered? Uh, I think that's the maze. I haven't seen the queen. There's the Jabberwocky. Uh, this. Oh, one sec. I should probably look at the photograph, huh? This photograph of my family was delivered here by post. No message, no return address. I'm grateful for this memento, but I wish I could thank the sender. So yeah, this is her uh, her family. They all got murdered. <laughs> in case you were wondering, that's why she's living in an orphan orphanage. Earn your keep. That's not fucking sketchy as fuck. Doctor's pet. Good for the asylum. Better without the charm. <laughs> Who'd want her? All these kids who are like less than two years old are talking shit at me. Fight me. Come on. You were out in the hallway. I told you to fight me. Stop talking shit about me. Anything else I can interact with over here? Like this chest? No. Of course not. <laughs> of course I just went out of my way to do nothing. Cool. Another day, a distant dream, perhaps. But yeah, this is a... Uh... I call work noble, you bastard. This is, uh, London? I think it's London. It's some British city. I'm assuming British. It looks very Victorian. Machine-made corsets? That sounds painful as fuck. Like, having a robot, like, tie up a corset. Sure, dude. I think we have to follow that white cat, so I'm gonna run in here and get yelled at by all these little kids. That's not fucking terrifying. Cool. She ever works? Where's her flat? Too good for company. She don't get through. I'm right here. What are they talking about? Hold on, what? <laughs> they talking about me or the girl in the corner? That's odd. Oh shit! There's kids right here. I didn't even see, I didn't even see this guy with this dapper looking hat. Holy shit! That is one cool ass top hat. 
Not as cool as a top hat we'll see later in the game, but pretty cool nonetheless. Yeah. <laughs> Are you drunk? It's like the middle of the day. Even like morning time. Like what the Holy shit, this dude's got like no control over his life. I should be chasing this white cat. Hold on. Yeah, there we go. Puss puss. <laughs> Lol. <laughs> I think this is what I'm supposed to do, a four twenty sixty nine joke. Um That's some low hanging fruit to grab. Uh, Move along, Alex. Good. I can run you in just for being off your nut. <laughs> Fuck you too. This is a very linear game, in case you're wondering. We have to, we have to follow this cat. There's nowhere else to go. I don't think. Uh, follow my cat down a dark alley. This seems safe. Oh, well, what's this way? Hold on. What the fuck is this? All living things die eventually. Still, a creature remains are always. Uh, pungent? Poignant? Is this a horse? It looks too big to be a dog. Yeah, it looks like it's a, That one's a horse head. This one I don't... I don't quite know. It looks like a bobcat skull, but... I mean, I guess probably it's a dog. Yes, I'm trying to examine skulls. That's how... That's how weird this game's gonna get. You you guys okay? She needs some food. Holy shit. What are you, like a size negative three? What the? Holy crap. I know I'm skinny, but jeez. Eat some bread, will ya? Is it brothel? <laughs> All of these women are like matchsticks. It's <laughs> yes, brothel. <laughs> Seems following furry creatures into dark holes has become a habit. I hope it's not a vice. Get it? Because she chased the white rabbit, and now we're chasing a white rat. Uh, uh, white rat? White cat. It had the same ending. <laughs> it was close enough. Oh, fuck. Is that a Jabberwocky? No wonder she doesn't want to be touched. Holy shit, this is terrifying. <laughs> Where the fuck did all these guys come from? What? My star of the gospel, Alice Little. You're coming again, are you? Nurse Weasley. What luck. Quite some of many months. Out on your own? You look frazzled, dearie. Not doing well? Not really. Come along home then and look at my pretty pretty bear. I do. Oh, thanks. Visit. Our last visit cost me several pounds and got me nowhere. <laughs> Good I can recall where you named your rabbit got to. Uh it's not a rabbit, it's a cat. Still on edge. No surprise. Her kin roasted like chestnuts right before her eyes. Ten years in Rutger and the asylum wasted everyone's time. Dr. Bombay won't do better. Still hauling out her questions. The fire, her memory. I deserve consideration, don't I? Who found her her new clothes? Who got her a place at Bombay? Where'd she be without me? On the street, selling her backside. Yeah, they were prostitutes. She was stoned out the wall, pounding her too. But I know more than that. Kept her secrets, haven't I? Hurt to say, all died on my account. I couldn't save you. I've told her my silence is for sale. See, I'm a good sort, you know. Not like the man with that 
I'll put you whore. Oh, thou lawyer of yellow rats that took her stupid rabbit. Need money. My Need fucking her. rabbit? Oh, of course, as if she didn't make a donation to my upkeep. He yells and goes off her head. Says she can't remember her name. What I heard. This bitch. 